good morning and happy vlogmas day 23 no 24 if it is the 24th happy new year happy christmas eve i'm in the car stopped by the way i am in the duncan drive through <clears throat> i already ordered my duncan so i just have to pick it up but that is what i'm doing this morning i'm getting myself some duncan um i have a couple things to do today like edit a video um wrap some Christmas presents. Me and my grandma and my mom are um, frosting cookies, so that kind of thing. But I just wanted to show you guys my Target or my Duncan run. Okay, so these are all the cookies that we made yesterday. My mom and I made all of these. Um, they are heart sworn cookies, so they have a little bit of anise oil in them. And basically that makes them taste a little bit like black licorice. Um, which is weird. I love those cookies, but I hate black licorice. So a lot of people don't like those because they do taste like black licorice, but, um, I like the cookies and I don't like black licorice anyways. So I just finished uploading tomorrow's video. I can show you guys right here. That is tomorrow's video. Obviously you guys will be seeing it before you see this one, but yeah, I just, um, finished getting that up. I did the dishes that were left over in the sink from last night when we were making cookies. I started the dishwasher. Yeah, I've been super productive. So now I have to, um, it is two o'clock and I think my grandma's coming over at three to frost the cookies. Um, and I wanted to walk my dog because basically, so it is cold outside. It's like 37 degrees out. But this is like the warmest it'll be pretty much while I'm home. And I know my mom doesn't walk my dog very much because it's cold out. So like yesterday I took her out on a walk. So I kind of want to take her out on a walk again. I don't even know where she is. I think she went upstairs. Because um, my mom's working. But anyways, so I want to take my dog out on a walk. But I also have to wrap my presents from, well, I mean, I have until Friday to wrap them. But I would prefer to do it sooner than later. So... I'm going to do that. I'm going to walk Precious. Mm -hmm. Show you guys my room. Frost cookies. Wrap the presents. I don't know what else I'm doing other than that. But yeah. Hi Precious. Oh, okay. She doesn't want to look. Come back. Come here. Come here, precious. What? What's your deal? I just took her on a walk. So she's like hyper from the walk. Why are your teeth like that? What? What do you want? No. 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 What's wrong? What's wrong, precious? Where are you going? What are you doing? Okay, bye. What are you doing? What? I don't know what's wrong with her. Hello, guys. It is almost 11 p.m., um, but I just wanted to get on here and talk to you guys a little bit because I had planned to do my best and worst purchases today of 2020. So I'm going to set my phone up really quick right here just so I can tell you guys. Sorry, the angle and the lighting is really bad. I'll try to color correct, um, if I remember tomorrow, but I have a few things, um, that I would like to include into my best and worst purchases of 2020. 
So I'm going to start with the best and then I'll go to the worst. I only have a handful of things. I really don't have that much, but I just wanted to talk about them to you guys so you can know. So I don't have pretty much any of that physically with me right now. Sorry, my dog is right here. Um, she's getting annoyed that I keep moving around. Anyways, so two of the best purchases I have this year. First one was my iPad and my Apple Pencil. I used it so much this year. I'm like literally so glad that I got it. I have the iPad seventh generation and then the first generation Apple Pencil. And I use it to take all of my notes. Um, everything that I have for school is completely on my iPad and my laptop. And I'm so glad that I did that. I'm saving so much paper, so much time and just trying to be a little bit better for the environment and I think that it's helped me so much because not only as is it less paper but it's actually all in one spot so it's going to be much easier for me to access it um and then my dog is literally panting right now look say hi precious <laughs> okay well she stopped okay okay sorry back to what I was saying so the iPad, 10 out of 10 recommend, especially if you're in college. It's really great for learning and being able to figure out and like place into words what you're trying to say. My other best purchase is my apartment. Um, and I see a lot of people were saying like their apartments for college were like the worst thing that they purchased. But for me personally, that I had to be in person um, for cheer, I had to be in Louisville. My apartment was like the best thing that I literally got. I'm so glad I got out of the dorms. I'm so glad I had my own space. It was amazing and I love my apartment. It's literally the the best place I could have possibly chosen to live. So I'm really glad that I'm living there. So on to the worst purchases of 2020. Number one being Amazon Prime. It is is like 50% off for students I think um so I was getting it for like $7.50 a month and honestly I just wasn't using it that much for it to for me to be paying for it honestly I'm pretty sure my brother used it more than I did so I just I ended up canceling it because honestly like I said I wasn't really using it that much I, I don't order much on Amazon anyways my dog just moved I'll show you guys her in a second I don't order a lot on Amazon anyway, so for me to be paying for Prime every month just really wasn't, didn't make sense for me, and I just wasn't a fan. Second thing is, like, planners and calendars, paper versions. Um, I would say they just weren't, he just didn't use them, especially from, like, April to August. I did not use a planner at all didn't really pay attention to what I was doing when I had to do things like there was no reason because everything was online anyway so I didn't really need it it didn't really make sense yeah um <laughs> another thing is stylish clothes when I tell you I've worn a nice outfit maybe once or twice this entire quarantine I mean it I'm pretty much streetwear is really in right now and loungewear and like workout stuff and that's pretty much what I've spent most of my money on if I was buying clothes this year was like workout workout stuff and stuff like that so I'm probably gonna stick to that because in all honesty I don't see myself having to dress nice um unless I do end up having my internship in person in the spring so hopefully I do because that would be awesome but if you can hear my cat meowing in the background I'm really sorry um but yeah, stylish clothes, not really getting much use out of them right now. And the last thing that I think was like the worst purchase is fast food. I need to stop eating fast food. I luckily haven't had it at all um, this week. So starting from Saturday to now, I haven't had it at all. But it's just after practice when there's nothing open but McDonald's and Taco Bell. Like, so that's what I've been eating. So my goal for the new year, which I will make a whole video on like new year's resolutions, but my goal for the new year is to make my meals at home and then, um, meal prep for if I get hungry after practice so that I can eat after practice because 
with having an internship, a full-time student, and being a cheerleader, it's going to be incredibly hard for me. So I just need to make sure that I am eating and that I'm getting nutrition and all that. So I'm going to try to like, while I'm here in New York, I'm going to try to like find a couple of good recipes that I'll be able to meal prep for the week. And then I can just have breakfast, lunch, dinner, like all meal prepped out so that I don't have to worry about it while I'm busy. So I'll do that on like a Sunday and then, you know, but yeah, that'll probably be a different video another day. So that is it for my best and worst products or things that I bought this year. Um, yeah, it's 11.06. I'm gonna probably watch some either more YouTube or more Netflix until I fall asleep because today I didn't wake up until noon and I want to try to wake up a little bit earlier tomorrow just so I can get my video up a little bit earlier um but yeah I don't know what I'm gonna do tomorrow in all honesty I don't know what I do any day right now so I kind of want to work out tomorrow but I gotta find I gotta find a workout that I can do in my basement and um, I think it's supposed to rain either tomorrow or Thursday. So I got to figure out like basically what I do there. But yeah, so that is going to be it for today's. Oh, I was going to show you guys Precious. She's just sleeping in the middle of my bed. Literally the middle of my bed. She's such a princess. Anyways, that is going to be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel before you guys leave. And if, again, if you have any video requests, definitely leave them down below. And um, if you want an email from the U of L cheer, DM me on Instagram your email and I'll be sure to put it in and so that you can get one. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.